Um, so I wanted to, Paris, you said you get scared when I go live. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. So I wanted to share with you guys um, something that I did after I had the baby. I didn't want to just post it. I felt like I, it needed an explanation because it's um, kind of gross. But... Um, I just wanted to explain. So, a lot of you may have heard about um, how people, after they um, give birth, <laughs> Jason thinks this is so gross. He's already in the comments. So, yes, yes. So, I turned my placenta into capsules, and it really helped me with um, with like having a lot of energy it helped me heal faster melody's over here melody what are you doing melzy hi <laughs> so it really helped with um, me losing weight, um, me having a lot of energy. I was like walking around the next day after I gave birth. Um, but this is what they look like. And you can go to their website. Their Instagram is Mommy Made Encapsulation. Mommy Made Encapsulation, and it comes in this cute box. Like this. And mine's are bubblegum flavored. And um, it's supposed to help with um, preventing postpartum depression. It's supposed to help with... Um, the reason I wanted to take them was because I was really afraid that I might have postpartum depression because I heard that you can get it or you're more likely to get it when um, you have your babies close in age. So um, that was my main concern. And another big concern of mine was my hair got so long and beautiful while I was pregnant. And after I had Melody, my hair fell out, my edges fell out, I was like bald on the sides, and I didn't want that to happen again, I wanted to keep my hair, so I heard that this was a good remedy for that, so, so far so good, my hair hasn't fell out, like, I brush my hair in the shower, like there's no hair that comes out, it hasn't shedded, so, so far, that's been working, but I heard that, um, that your hair doesn't start falling out till like, after three months, so I'm gonna do another review to let you guys know if it really works or not but so far i've lost the baby weight i'm gonna show you guys myself in the mirror i've lost the baby weight so i don't have on a race trainer or anything lost the baby weight and it's been a month since i've had the baby and I still have like a couple more pounds to go, but it really, it really um, just came off naturally. Um, so now I'm just waiting to see if my hair, I'm going to keep my pregnancy hair because that was like my main concern. I didn't want to lose my hair. But yeah, it's mommy made encapsulation and then they made like, his umbilical cord into like gold so cute but it says that it um, helps oh yeah and it helps increase your milk supply for those of you who want to breastfeed and I feel like it helped a lot with that um, epic at his first visit he was born at seven pounds and at his first visit, he was already at 10 pounds, and my doctor actually told me to stop 
um, giving him the milk that I pumped in the bottle to only um, breastfeed him because I guess my milk was so strong that he was like gaining so much weight. He was already nine and a half pounds by the time he went to his first visit to the doctor. Um, so it helps with increased energy, increased milk supply. It helps prevent baby blues and postpartum depression. It replenish, replenishes your iron levels. It reduces postpartum bleeding, reduces stress returns to pre-pregnancy size faster and faster healing and recovery from pregnancy. And then they even make you a video showing you the process of um, how they turned your placenta into pills. And another thing, hold on. And they did an imprint of my placenta. So this was his actual placenta. And then they cut the umbilical cord off and they turn it into, um, I don't, gold something. It's like hard and like painted with gold. Um, so you don't have to keep their umbilical cord because I did that with Melody and it's pretty gross. I have it just sitting there in the um, drawer. So, I just wanted to share that with you guys. I didn't want to just post it because I felt like it needed an explanation um, as to why I turned my placenta into pills. And I'm over halfway done with them. Um, let's see, what are you guys asking? So mommy made encapsulation. That's the Instagram name. I'm going to make a post in my stories and then I'm going to tag them too. But it's mommy made encapsulation exactly the way that it's spelled. Oh, it's, I went on the website, it's $200. Um, it's $200, and they come and they pick up your placenta in the, um, at the hospital. I'm not sure if they do it out of state or how that works, but you can go to their website and, um, and see for yourself. But it's $200. Um, let's see. Do you vaccinate? Um, Melody got her first set of shots, her two month shots. I was on the fence about that because I hear all these stories and all that. So I wasn't going to, and then I ended up doing it anyway. And she ended up having a bad reaction. It was like inconsolable crying or unconsolable crying and she was in a lot of pain. So I decided to stop after that. And then my pediatrician agreed that we should stop after that. So I think I'm gonna do the same thing with him. I'll probably let him get his first set. I don't know, I don't, I'm, I'm on the fence about it. I don't know, I still don't know. I might let him get his, um, first set or maybe do them one at a time and see how he reacts and if he doesn't react well then I'm going to not do them anymore you hungry you hungry want your strawberries Bowie. Bowie. <laughs> Bowies. Okay, you guys, Melody's hungry. <laughs> okay. Melody's hungry, so let me hurry up and tend to her. Um, do you guys have any more questions before I get off? Hey, Phaedra. No, they don't have a bad taste because they, you could pick what, um, what flavor you want, and I picked bubblegum.
Um, trying to see if you guys have any more questions. When the oh, so somebody asked when the pills are done, do you have to take more? So you take them like the first couple days. You take like um, you take to like three at a time, three times a day. Or I was taking like four at a time. You can take as many as you want, but you take more in the beginning, and after like a couple days, you taper down. And what that does is um, so after you give birth. All your hormones are in the placenta and it's just like out of your body. And so the imbalance of hormones cre um, creates an imbalance. And then that's when like all the bad symptoms start to happen. Maybe postpartum depression because it's like a huge um, difference in hormones after you have the baby. So you're able to, with the pills, when you, when you take the pills, you're able to slowly slowly um, release the hormones from your body you basically get to like taper off of them instead of just you know all of them just gone so that's when your hair falls out that's when like you get postpartum depression but I feel like it helped a lot how long did it take to receive them after they pick it up so they picked it up the day I, um, the day I gave birth, and then they, they, um, they start the process right away, and then they, they were at my house by like the third, by like the third or fourth day or something like that. My C-section, um, my C-section went great. Oh, and I did this thing called, um, if you guys are pregnant and you guys plan on having a C-section, tell your doctor you want to do the Pico dressing. And it's like this new thing they do with um, C-sections. There's no scar, there's no swelling. Um, I wasn't in any pain. I was in the hospital making Melody breakfast the next day after I gave birth. I'm not sure if it's only available in LA, but you can um, check the website out. And I'm gonna leave this um, video up for a long time. So, any more questions? How do you make sure you get your placenta? Because they uh, record the whole process. So, they record them taking it out of um, when they pick it up, you put it inside of a uh, cooler, little cooler, and you tell the hospital that you want to save your placenta. So they'll, the hospital will put it in the cooler for you, and then Mommy Made Capsulation will come, and Mommy Made Encapsulation will come and pick it up, and they write your name on it and all that. With Melody, I um, I was like, I couldn't even walk. I was like limping afterwards. I was in so much pain. And this time around, I was in no pain. Like I actually stopped taking my, um, my medicine in the hospital. Are they chewable? I wouldn't chew them. I wouldn't chew them.
let me show you guys the um, thing again. So they come in this. And then they, um, they think they steam it and then they turn it into powder and then they put it inside of the pills. This is their Instagram, Mommy Made Encapsulation. Excuse my nails. I haven't gone to the nail salon the whole time since I've had him. All right. If you guys don't have any more questions pertaining to the placenta pills, um, I'm gonna, uh, what you doing? Go make Melody her lunch. So I'll keep this video up for a while. And then, um, so you guys can listen to it again. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it up. So if you got here late, you'll be able to watch the video again. But I'm talking about my placenta that got turned into pills and the benefits of them and why I would recommend them for everybody. I'm not sure how many pills, um, but there's a lot. I don't know how many exactly. Maybe a couple hundred, I don't know. Maybe a hundred, I don't know. Maybe a couple hundred. Okay, guys. Okay, guys, I'm gonna, no, I don't know if they expire. Probably, you should take them um, right away so you have the baby. Okay, bye guys.